Hello guys it's your boy Captain Boss and today you're going to find out the difference between a couple of errors and an inside the park home run let's just get right in the video right now I'll see you there. These are a couple of errors which allows the runners to score. Right by the diving Espinosa stopping at second and the ball goes through Taylor's legs. Here comes Kendrick to tie. Puig is on his way. The relay is double clutch. Can you believe it? The Dodgers win it for the three. Ground ball headed up the middle. That's going to score the run. And it gets by Kiermaier. He's going to have to chase it all the way to deep center. Kane heads to third. And they're going to wave him around. And Kansas City will take a 3-1 to one lead. As you can see on that play there was an error that occurred that allowed the batter to score if if it if there was no error then it would just be single and the run would score so he gets the RBI but only gets a single and E8 which means it's called a single and a three base error because he had a single and an error by the center fielder as known as an E8 allowed him to advance three more bases E8 is called 8 because the center fielder is known as 8. Pitcher is one catcher to two etc. E9 by the center fielder is what we call a single and a three base error. These are inside the park home runs with no errors. Long run. And Torrey Hunter made the play and then lost his glove as he in the park with Kelly. And Kelly can't find it. And that's an inside the park home run for Lorenzo Kane and Torrey Hunter is hurt. And the 0-2. Bloop to left field. That could be trouble. Coming on a span. He can't make the play. And it gets by him. And it rolls down the left field line. Off to the races is Gardner. He's rounding third. They're waving him home. Here's the throw. Here's the play at the plate. And inside the park home run. Brett Gardner. It's 4-2 twins. As you can see on those plays, no errors were made which allowed the batters to score. That's all for MLB differences.